what a performance, what a song, what a feeling that it generated. <laughs> hey superstars, HBK Luke here. Hope you sexy boys and girls are doing great, baby. Let's go. Woo! And today's song comes courtesy of the iconic Julien, and it is Mylene Farmer, Avant L'Ombre. Apologies if I butchered any of that. I went for it. I went with the accents as well. Hopefully it's okay, but I do apologize if that's wrong, which translates to Before the Shadow. Really looking forward to checking this out because I have not seen any of Mylene's work and uh, I cannot wait. So without further ado, please, let's get to it. Please like, subscribe, get your comments in. It is showtime. Rain always makes it better, right? Adds to it. Okay, I am loving this so far. First of all, singing in French. The French language is just beautiful, B E A, beautiful to listen to. I think when you just hear those little accents, those little rolls of the tongue, it just adds to the song. Her voice is great, um, but also I'm loving this almost heartbeat effect that we're getting in the music as well. Uh, it's just, yeah, really liking this and the visuals as well of the whole performance. Beautiful. Qui me ramène 
goodness, this was spectacular. What a performance, what a song, what a feeling that it generated. Big shout out to Julian for recommending this. Wow. I mean, the build and build and build of this song was just immense. The audience was so into it. I love seeing the audience singing along and the, the emotion on their face and it warranted it because this was just amazing. Her voice to start with, you know, to start out we've got this light feeling and then when she hits those high notes but she creates this almost like echo, distant effect which is just stunning. The drummer, we have to talk about the drummer because oh my goodness, the guy, he was so into it. You could see that it was running through him the song. We had almost that heartbeat effect at the start and then as it got more and more, it became just this feeling and this speeding up and as though we were kind of like walking towards the end, you know. When we get the chimes coming in, this like bell effect as well that time is running out and everything speeds up to this climax. Um, wow, just spectacular. And that guitar was just awesome throughout. And again, it just built and built and built. Um, and I loved it because it was, it was like a heart beating faster and faster, knowing that it's not got long left and time is running out. And that's really the feeling that, uh, that came in. And that was almost the effect, right? She was walking up the steps accepting death and I thought well, that was great you know we saw her clothes come taking off her clothes almost like this acceptance you know and I'm going in now and this is me and this is me in my my natural form I thought that was great as well you know almost like you're accepting it going completely vulnerable and here it is and I think that's what this song was about you know almost this fear of death to start with you know or knowing that you've not got long left but but also kind of being grateful for life at the same time um, but, but really feeling that fear, but then overcoming it towards the end. I mean, this song just freaking awesome. Cannot get over how, how good that performance was as well. And the set was just incredible and the colors and everything else. The fact that was the, the rain coming down, it just made it a super spectacle. Yeah. And I cannot wait to check out more because this was phenomenal. I'll probably miss something, but yeah unbelievable. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Please like and subscribe. And if you want to support me and get more content, join the HBK fan club at patreon.com slash HBK Luke. And with that, HBK Luke is signing out, brother. <laughs>